Russia, we are Russia, say the lyrics to the song. Russia! And they may get their wish in 10 days' time. The crowd in front of the Crimean parliament was celebrating today's announcement that the referendum on whether Crimea should stay in Ukraine or rejoin Russia has been brought forward. There's little doubt which way this referendum is going to go. It's being organized in extraordinary haste by the new Crimean government backed by Russia. The authorities in Kiev won't recognize the results, nor will the European Union, nor will the USA. But Russia will, and Crimea will effectively be part of Russia again. A few blocks away, Lenin looked on as people signed a petition in support of his statue remaining. One of his successors, Nikita Khrushchev, gave Crimea to Ukraine in 1954. To many here, the referendum is a chance to right a historical wrong. Khrushchev gave us away 60 years ago, and now we want to come back. This is our land, and I want to be in Russia. A few miles away, the largely Tatar village of Stroganovo was quiet. Many here fear a referendum will inflame anti-Tatar sentiment amongst ethnic Russians. Sure, sure. Who could be calm in this situation? It's a tinderbox. We cannot hide. This is our land, and we have nowhere else to go. The crowd shouted their support for the referendum, but it's hard to see what difference it will make. Inside the parliament, Crimean deputies voted to leave Ukraine and join Russia. The decision has already been made.